Okay, here we have uh, an example uh, related to whole patch equation. So the equation says that the yield strength of mild steel with an average given size of 0.05 mm is 20,000 psi. The yield stress of the same steel with a grain size of 0.007 mm is 40,000 psi. Determine the average grain size of the same steel with a yield stress of 30,000 psi. And we assume that whole page equation is valid. And uh, changes in the observed yield stress are due to the changes in grain size. So we are given the yield strength of mild, mild steel. And we are given D. So when the yield strength of the mild steel equals to 20,000 PSI, the grain size, average grain size is 0 0.05. And the yield stress of the same steel with a grain size of 0 0.007 millimeter is 40,000 PSI. So now we need to determine the average grain size of the same steel with a yield stress of 30,000, 30,000 PSI. So first we need to write down the whole patch equation. So whole patch equation is sigma y equals to sigma naught plus k divided by square root of d. Sigma y is a yield strength. This is yield strength. And sigma naught and k is constant. And d is the grain size diameter. d is a grain size diameter. So first we need to convert PSI to megapascal. So we need to convert the given value in PSI to megapascal if we want to find the value of D in millimeter. So for grain size of 0 0.05, the yield stress is 20,000. The yield stress is 20,000 PSI. So we need to convert 20,000 PSI to megapascal, uh, not that 1,000 PSI. So 1,000 PSI equals to 6.895 megapascal, so 20,000 PSI times 6.895 megapascal divided by 1000 psi so we cancel psi on both sides and we will get 137.9 megapascal so 20000 psi 20000 psi is equal to 137.9 megapascal and how about a uh, 40000 psi so 40000 psi if we convert to megapascal using the same technique, then we will get 40,000 PSI equals to 275.875.8 two megapascal. Okay, so now we can write down the equation like this. We can write down the equation like this. 275.8 equals to sigma naught plus k divided by square root of grain, grain size 0 0.007 and the second equation is 137 megapascal 137.9 megapascal is uh, 20,000 PSI we convert it to megapascal we get this value 137.9 megapascal equals to sigma naught plus k divided by the grain size the square root of grain size equals to 0 0.05 and using a simultaneous equation so now we can use 
simultaneous equation to find the value of k to find k so we just minus uh, 275.8 minus 137.9 is equal to 1 275, 275.8 minus 137.9 equals to 137.9 and sigma naught minus uh, sigma naught equals to 0 and k okay we can also write down this as 12.4 k okay, we can write it down it down as uh, okay we can write uh, k divided z uh, square root of 0 0.007 as 12.04 k and this one we can write it down as 4.48 k so sigma naught minus uh, sigma naught equals to 0 and 12.04k minus 4.48k, we will get 7.56k. So, k equals to 18.24. So, this is the value of k. This is the value of k. So, now we can find so we already know the value of k so now we can find sigma naught so we can choose any of uh, this equation so we choose uh, the first equation here we can write it down as sigma naught plus so the value of k for both equation for this and this equals to since uh, this is the same material, so the value of k for both equation is equal, equals to 18.24. 18.24 divided by the grain size 0 0.007 equals to 275.8 megapascal. So solving for sigma naught. 275.8 minus 18.24 divided by the square root of 0 0.007 so the sigma naught will be equal to 55.5 megapascal so this is the value of a sigma naught equals to 55.5 uh, megapascal Okay, so now we have a whole page equation. We can write the whole page equation as a sigma y. And now we already know the value of a sigma naught equals to 55.5 plus the value of k, the constant k equals to 18.24 divided by the square root of a grain size. So the question asks, Determine the average grain size of the, uh, of the same steel. We need to determine the average grain size of the same steel with a yield stress of 30,000 PSI. So we need to determine the grain size. So if we want to determine the, uh, the value of D at 30,000 PSI, so first, of course, we need to convert 30,000 PSI to megapascal. So 30,000 PSI will be equal to 206.9 to a 6.9 megapascal. So we just uh, plug in the value to find uh, the value of a grain size. So 18.24 divided by square root of grain size plus uh, 55.5 equals to 2 or 6.9 megapascal so 
we just uh, rearrange this equation. 18.24 divided by 2 or 6.9 minus 55.5 equals to square root of D. So the square root of D equals to 0 0.1 to 1. So we just uh, square both sides. And the value of D equals to 0 0.0147 millimeter. So the answer is when uh, the average grain size of the same steel with a yield stress of 30,000 PSI, then the grain size will be equivalent to 0 point, 0 0.0147 millimeter. So the answer is 0 0.0147 millimeter.